In today's video, I'm going to be showing you how a combination of two different waves compressors never fail me on any type of vocals. Without wasting much of your time, let's get into the video. Hi guys, welcome back to the channel. If you're new to the channel, my name is Che. I make music production tutorials on YouTube in Cubase and FL Studio. Consider subscribing and click that post notification bell so that you get notified every single time I upload a brand new video. Today, I want to share with you guys how I combine two different waves compressors to get a more professional sounding vocal. So before we actually get into it, let me explain my vocal chain to you. The first plugin on my vocal chain is a corrective EQ where I'm just correcting some of those frequencies that we may not need in the mix. After that, I've got a compressor, which is the first compressor in the vocal chain and one that we're going to talk about in this video. After this compressor, I've got the additive EQ, which is just to boost some of those sweet spots on the vocal, a deesser, and finally the second compressor, which we are going to talk about in this video as well. The first compressor right here is Aravox. So I use Aravox to kind of get some consistency in the vocal right here. So what I do on this compressor is take the gain to negative six. I'll start pushing the threshold here until I see a reduction of negative three to negative four right here. I'm trying to be where the pay is, or I'm trying to be where the stage is, or I might just be where the scale is. I don't wanna be on no fakeness. Yeah, let's step it, let's do on some lace shit. He got, and he fell on the pavement. Yeah, we all got some problems, we face it. Oh, my nigga don't end up in a station. I need to bust down, or I might need a two tone. So once I'm satisfied with the level and consistency in the vocal, I move on to the next compressor, which comes after the additive EQ and the deesser. So I'll just switch on this compressor right here. So the second compressor is the Aracomp. I'll just set this mode to Opto and set the attack to 1, the release to 50, and the ratio to 2. So after this is done, I'll start pushing the threshold right here and just make sure that the gain reduction here is not more than three. I'll just maintain it in here. My nigga saying I'ma go far. My nigga saying I'ma make it. Too high, don't hear what you saying. No, I ain't done when you been on some fake shit. I'm trying to be where the pay is. Or I'm trying to be where the stage is. Or I might just be where the scale is. I don't want to be on no fakeness. Yeah, let's step it. Let's do on some lace shit. He got, then he fell on the pavement. Yeah, we all got some problems. We face it. Oh, my nigga don't end up in a station. I need a bust down or I might need a two-tone Tell him no run now when I make it like who knows My nigga saying I'ma go far My nigga saying I'ma make it Too high, don't hear what you saying No, I ain't done when you been on some fake shit I'm trying to be where the pay is Or I'm trying to be where the stage is Or I might just be where the scale is I don't wanna be on no fakeness Yeah, let's step it, let's do on some lace shit He got, then he fell on the pavement Yeah, we all got some problems, we face it Oh, my nigga don't end up in a station I need a bust down or I might need a two tone. Tell them no run now when I make it like who knows. Alright guys, so basically this is how I use this combination of these two compressors. There's just something about combining these two compressors that gives a very good sounding vocal. Thanks a lot for watching. If you enjoyed this video, don't forget to give it a thumbs up because it helps the channel grow. If you are new to the channel, subscribe, click that post notification bell so that you get notified next time I upload a brand new video. Comment in the comment section below. Let me know what you think. Follow me on Instagram or Facebook at JDMG. Let's interact there. See you in my next video. Peace.